Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Wednesday and I haven't vlogged anything again today. We've just had uh, a do nothing type of day. It is now uh, 10 to 3 and um, I have not really done much. I uploaded the, the vlog this morning and then watched some YouTube. Um, I started drawing, um, so there's a few YouTube channels that I follow that do draw with me on Procreate and you just f basically copy what they're doing to get ideas on how to draw stuff and like the different, I like it for using the different um, like techniques on, on the app um, and learning them and seeing what they do and all stuff like that. Um, so I, I was doing that then Ian got me some new headphones. I will show you them now. Um, he, I know, I knew he ordered them because he asked me, and I was like, I really like them. So he's ordered me some Skull Candy headphones. They're over the head ones, and they are. Like they headphones. Yeah, not. I suppose not earphones. Headphones. Um, I'm going to come in here because the light is a bit better in here. Um, Oh, it's very bright now. <laughs> um, but they're like an orangey, pinky, peachy colour and ombre and oh, I love them so much. Um, I'm just about to make a coffee and a couple of people have commented um, asking about the coffee machine that I have got. So if you're not interested, I'm sorry, but I just thought I would quickly just show you the coffee machine um, and what it does and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, it's not really a tutorial, but I just thought I'd I'd really I'd show you quickly. Let me spin you round um, and turn the light on because it might give us a bit more light over here. Okay, so this is the machine that we've got. It's the DeLonghe Magnifica Evo, um, and this little bit here comes up and down for depending on what cup size. Um, I just put this here because when the machine starts up and when it stops, it cleans the nozzle. Um, and I thought I would just leave this here instead of this getting full up too quickly because um, there is a little thing in there to say like when that is hits the top it's full up so to empty it um, but yeah so this machine it does filter coffee so uh, basically coffee that's like this and you can use your beans um, inside of it as well so uh, you just put your coffee beans at the back and then if you want to use filter you just put your um, your your spoons worth <laughs> of coffee in there and it will disregard the um, the grinding bit here is where you can put some cups I've just turned it off um, so yeah this is the on and off button I've just pressed that by accident but because I haven't made a coffee it shouldn't drip because it's already done that yeah so it's just switched off um, here is the nozzle for hot water so you can just have hot water here is the the water tank so that just com comes in and out really easily and then this here opens up and there is the used coffee and then you just empty that um, everything does come up with um, on here so if it runs out of water it will come up with a little light um, if that um, compartment down there needs empty and it will come up with a little light um, I'm not sure about running out of beans or anything because I haven't done that yet um, in my fridge I did fill this up I have this which is the milk thruffer I filled this up last night um, and all you do is you just pull that off and push that on that is all you do um, and then you up here is a few different options so you can have um, a my latte and what that does is uses however much milk you've got in this container however much you put in there um, and then one shot of espresso you have a ca cappuccino uh, espresso coffee and just hot water and then here is your beans and you press this one if you're using just filter and it won't grind anything um, so yeah that is basically the machine um it works really well for us um i really like the coffee that comes out of it obviously you can have different strengths and at the back you can decide how 
uh, much you want the beans to be ground as well there's a, a setting on the back um, yeah it does everything that I, I wanted it to do um, yeah so Ian didn't really drink coffee before this <laughs> uh, but he loves a cappuccino and you can what you can do as well like you can set these things so it comes obviously as a default but when you make a coffee it makes quite a small coffee so you if you I did YouTube it and if you hold the button in it will fill the cup up to where you want it then you press it again it will stop and it will store that as your measure so that's what I've done I've just used like our regular cups um, like this um, like a regular size and we just use that to have our drinks uh, yeah it needs a clean at the back it's a bit a bit grubby at the back see it does it does splash sometimes as well um, but yeah that is the machine really and I'm really happy with it I'm not sponsored so I'm just showing showing you what it's like um, but now I'm gonna make a couple of coffees and um, sit and enjoy them I am going to, I might put a square in my cosy memory blanket actually. Um, I did put all of the yarn in the bag and I think four was smaller than five grams. So a lot did go in the bag, so that's really good. Right, let's make coffees. So I've just turned the machine back on and up here, so this is the strength. I don't know if you can see, there's, there's only, there's this light here on, so it's, like medium. Ian doesn't like he's too strong so I will just press that to have one light on. Uh, is that better? That might be a bit better. Um, so I've only got one light on and then we have cappuccino so I have put this on, I've put the um, the milk frother arm out, press the cappuccino button, it grinds the coffee the milk will come through into the cup, then the coffee will. Now if you're using um, filter, then it won't grind that coffee like it just did. Um, it will just uh, override that and just use the, the grounds that you put. Um, so yeah, this is what it does. Now the milk is finished, now the coffee is going to go in and that will fill the cup. What I'm going to do for this one is put it in a clear cup so you can see. Um, so I always have mine on medium and cappuccino. that is it. I will give that a stir because I have sweetener in mine so and Ian does as well so give it a stir so it won't look as pretty but um, yeah it's a great little machine and I really like it. Um, so that's going to be enough of me going on about that. Um, you just press the button as well, um, this button here to clean the nozzle. Uh, there's enough for one more coffee in that little uh, pot. So yeah I I'm going to do some knitting and then do some dinner a bit later. Um, that's about it really. Weather's been a bit weird. It's raining, sunny, raining, sunny. <laughs> um, I've also been trying to drink more water. But anyway, right, let's drink this coffee and do some knitting. Hello. Good evening now and good evening on the next day. <laughs> it is now Thursday um, and I didn't finish the vlog yesterday. I didn't um, start anything this morning. Uh, yeah, so I'm here now. I am about to do dinner. What is going on with my hair? I put my hairband in and it's wet. Um, anyway, so... I'm about to do some dinner, we're having bacon, egg and chips with beans and I'm really looking forward to it because I'm really hungry. 
Um, I've got a uh, membership Zoom tonight with Mandy uh, from Mousy's Makes. And yeah, so what have I been up to? So I've been, all I've been knitting on is my cosy memory blanket. I got that out and I put the yarns in uh, the bag and I was like, oh, I'll just put a square in. I feel like that's something I want to do. Um, so I did that and I've put in about four or five now. <laughs> Um, so I'm going to carry on doing that, let's see if I can bring forward just for a better light I suppose. Um, so I'm going to carry on doing that tonight because that's what I fancy. I might knit a bit on my socks as well so they've got to be finished by the end of the month and then I can pull another one out. Um, so yeah I'm just enjoying knitting on something a little bit different. Um, I didn't work on my Alpine Bloom at all. Uh, so yeah I'm just going to do do that really. Um, and we went to, um, Ian needed to pick up some parts for his car today and so we went and did that and then we went to the garage for a bit because he wanted, so Bill's and Ian have been cleaning the garage up and tight, well tidying it up um, so they can actually get a car in there um, but Ian just needed to move a few bits around so we took my car, we've got the same car um, and same, similar, same it's a, it's a Mark IV Golf. Um, he's, he's obviously... He's, he's different, but it's the same. <laughs> um, and he wanted to make sure that his car would fit in there. And so I reversed mine in, it would fit in okay. You just had to move a few, few things around. Um, my car has stopped leaking, but the carpet is still wet. But I think it's just uh, the condensation and where I had the heating on last week in the car while I was driving it around. It's dried the top layer. Um, but then, because it's got cold again, the wet from underneath has come up again. So I'm hoping that um, the more I use the car and the more that I, it sort of warms up outside, it will dry out. Um, the boot carpet was really wet, so I've taken it out and left it in the garage, and hopefully that will dry out again. Um, but yeah, so that is that is basically all we've really been up to. Um, and I, have, I haven't felt like I've got anything worth vlogging. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to end these two days here because I just don't feel like there's anything to it. I showed you the coffee machine um, earlier on in this vlog, which would have been yesterday. And I just feel like there is nothing worth vlogging at the moment. Like, um, I'm only knitting on my cosy memory blanket and I'm not really doing much. Uh, so what I am going to do is um, from maybe today, maybe tomorrow, start a vlog again and then uh, do a weekend like Easter vlog. So um, just vlog the weekend and then from Monday I might just start weekly vlogs. Um, I do enjoy vlogging and I enjoy chatting and just rambling about what I'm making and stuff. Um, so instead of podcasts and stuff, I, I, I think I might just do weeklies, um, show you what I've been up to, a bit of what, like what I've been up to crafty wise, what I've been up to uh, everyday life wise and stuff. Um, and I know a lot of people enjoy that, so yeah, that's, that's the route that I'm going to go down and I'm going to edit this. Uh, this evening and get this uploaded. We are going to my uncle's tomorrow, me and my sister and the boys. Um, so I can always vlog that and I can add that to the weekend vlog. Um, Saturday and Sunday, obviously we're going to Slimming World on Saturday morning, but I don't know what we're doing over the weekend. Um, I'm not 100% sure yet. We haven't planned anything. Um, so yeah, that that's it. I'm going to start some dinner because I am hungry and... Um, Hopefully have a nice evening. Um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I just want to say also thank you for everyone uh, watching my March daily vlogs. Um, I really do appreciate that you come along and comment and everything. So thank you so much. Um, and I hope you stay around for the weekly vlogs as well. Um, I used to do weekly vlogs quite a lot. And they're normally between <laughs> sort of... 45 minutes to an hour, um, my weekly vlogs. Sometimes they're shorter, sometimes they're longer, it all depends. Um, so I'll see how that goes for a little while and then you never know, I might go back to daily, I might go 
I don't know, to a few days at a time, um, it's just as and when it works for me really. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching, thank you for sticking around for March vlogs, and I shall see you all in the next one. Bye!